Hello folks, this is Scott with Dallas Paint Correction and Auto Detailing here in Dallas, Texas. Sorry for this weird angle. I'm trying to hold the camera and have a conversation with you guys. So just bear with me if it's a little shaky. I want to talk about the center console. The center console is always made out of plastic. Typically made out of plastic, right? A lot of guys will call me and say, Scott, how do I remove scratches? hide scratches on the center console inside of a car because it's made out of plastic. That can be a bummer sometimes. I've, I've seen guys like wet, they'll take some sandpaper to get rid of scratches, they'll actually paint it. It can be a real bummer when it gets scratched. Sometimes you can use like a, you know, a heavy dressing to kind of disguise or hide the scratches. The way my mind works is I want to prevent the scratches in the first place. So I want to solve the problem before it becomes a problem. Does that make sense? The biggest reason we get a lot of scratches on the side console is you see the seatbelt buckle? It rests right up against the center console. You drive down the road, this thing kind of bounces around and vibrates and all of a sudden you'll get scratches in that area. It will drive you nuts. So the way my mind works is how do I prevent that problem from happening from having that seatbelt buckle scratch the side. Folks, what I'm gonna show you is a really cool trick. I don't, I don't know anybody who does this. I could be wrong, but I'm willing to say that maybe this is the first time you'll ever see it on YouTube, and I hope it helps you. The seatbelt buckle, because it's made out of plastic, will bounce around against this side console. You're constantly buckling in and out of the car. Even if you don't have somebody in this side of the car, you drive down the road, it vibrates. Folks, what I'm gonna show you is a really cool trick. Watch when I push this seatbelt buckle over. Take a look at this. Can you guys see what I have on top of that? This is like a, I'll show it to you in a minute, but you can buy these at an arts and crafts store, Lowe's, Home Depot. They're like a velvet type of material with a sticky surface. You peel it off a little cardboard holder it comes with. I think you put these things below like uh, hardwood uh, chairs or something like that underneath the feet of the chair so they don't scratch your hardwood floors inside your home. Now, this very soft velvet type of thing, if I let go of the seatbelt buckle and it hits the side of that plastic piece, it can't scratch the uh, center console. Isn't that really cool? I can rub it up against here, but that little cushion, that little barrier stops this plastic piece from scratching the plastic um, center console. Here is, you can buy these things, arts and craft stores, Home Depot, wherever you wanna buy them. Again, I think they put them on the bottom of chairs to stop your chairs from scratching hardwood floors. They can be round, they can be square, they can come in different colors. I chose black for this because I have a black interior, right? But my Infinity has brown, light brown buckles and a light brown console. So I'm gonna use this light brown colored type of cushions and put it behind that seatbelt buckle. Folks, isn't that really cool? I wanted to share that with you. Stop scratches from happening in the first place and you don't have to worry about it later. I love you guys, I'll talk to you soon.